Welcome, 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 Caspers. The best community in the whole wide bloody world. You know it. I know it. We all bloody know it. Here we are. Hello and welcome to God's Basement. <laughs> Imagine Echo now. <laughs> I've, got a <coughs> I've got a chest infection. Okay, and look, I'm so sorry it's been a while. I'm so sorry it's been a while that I posted up on, on YouTube. Streaming, well, streaming we go on Twitch normally. You know it, you know it. But um, yeah, it's been Christmas. It's been New Year. Um, I was in Madrid and I've been ill and all that. Let me turn me, let me turn me, let me, let me turn me down. Maybe turn me down a little bit, y'all. So, um, as you can hear by my croaky voice, or my sexy voice, yeah, I've got, a, I've got a, I think it's a chest infection. I think it is. I'm coughing up stuff, so probably it is. Anyway, hello, how, how, how the devil are you? Hello, B Swift Gaming Team Ben. Yeah. Uh, Lissandy. What's on? XX, this channel, XX. Don't be sorry. I ain't sorry, yo. I, I ain't sorry. I'm a little bit sorry. I'm a little bit sorry. Winchester girl, Shannon. He's back. Hi. Yes, I am back with a vengeance. Look, to be honest with you, I actually recorded a video today. Um, it was uh, Panama because we've, we've gained quite a lot of um, Indonesian followers and the 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 video is Pamela Pamela is going crazy over there at the moment so they want me to play it so I recorded it I was halfway editing and I thought I just don't know because the sound is so bad someone's been messing with my mic mate someone's been messing with my mic and it sounded super bad you could hear my keys tapping away even clicking it was like You could hear that, and how annoying is that? So I don't know, I might have to use some editing genius software, whatever, I, I might upload it, I might just record it again, uh, maybe, because it's not like one of those games where you you play it once and that's it. You've got like 35 different endings. Anyway, I'm really looking forward to playing this God's Basement, because last stream, mate, my God, last stream, it was, it was on another level. It was on another bloody level. Mackenzie, hey, Hoff. My husband and I watched all the parts of you playing Soma. Loved it. I did like that. That was one of those um, games where I played it until I got stuck, super stuck, and then left it for a year, came back to it, and I was like, what was I stuck about? I was just, I carried on straight away to it. Um, Crimson, hello, mate. Hey, yo, Lexi. Uh, that's a good name. Hello, how are you doing? Fo I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm feeling a little bit better. These are kind words. Anyway. Without further ado, our diddly day. Let's get into the horror. Yes. Graphics. Maximum graphics, please. Yes, sir. That's a bloody. Is it? Uh, can we do ultra? No, you can't. You're fine, lies. All right. Let me play the bloody game. Your fiance is super sick as well. Oh man. Oh, that's not good. Lawrence, what's on, mate? Hey, discovered your channel recently. Love your vids. Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't usually sound like this clearly. I might, I might, I quite dig it, though. I quite dig this. Okay, shush! Press the interact key to use objects. E. Okay, look at this, mate. This is freaky deaky, mate. If you haven't seen this, right? If you haven't seen this game yet, then I, I I really suggest you go back and check out my other video. I think it's a video or two videos, two videos. Oh Christ! <gasps> Ooh, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just continue. Eh? Unlock chapters. Reset progress. F you, mate.
Hang on, let me just read this thoroughly. Due to the nature of updating the game, you can lose all your progress. I just added the all because that sounds quite dramatic. You can lose your progress after an update has occurred. This would be very inconvenient, absolutely, for someone who has already played through the entire game and would like to revisit certain parts of it after an update. Use the buttons below if you would like to unlock all the levels within the game or reset your progress. I do not want to reset my progress. I'm, I'm presuming that light blue... It's nominated light blue right now. There we go. Okay, unlock chapters, please. Hang on a second. I don't understand. Can I not just continue? Load game. Oh, mate. Oh. Just load game, mate. Just load the game. It's loading. It's loading. Oh, man. Genesia Royal, hello. Cause you're royal. Na 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 na. I wish I knew the words to that because it's a bloody good song. And also, you should check out the YouTube video of her doing it on cups. She play, she sings the song on cups. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. Paper cups. Anyway, shut up, Ben. Let's get on with the horror. Oh yeah, he was saying something about left room and right room, if I remember. I think he said about going to the left room. Let's go. Is it good sound for you? Is it good sound for me? It's good sound for me. Door's not very good though. Shh. Visitors, please report to the office. Okay. What? Oh, mate, don't give me a puzzle straight away. At least, like... James, it's been a while since our last encounter. That was <coughs> a lot of information to absorb. I hope you got most of it, but I'll try to summarize the best that I can. You were trying your hardest to get by high school while also taking care of your grandmother, along with holding a part-time job. Mm -hmm. At the end of high school... You had amazing grades and received a full-ride scholarship. Mm -hmm. The only problem was you would have to leave your grandmother to attend college. She raised you all by herself after your parents passed away. It tore you up inside, <gasps> knowing that you would have to abandon her to move forward in your life. Slowly but surely, her condition kept deteriorating. <laughs> to the point where it was an extreme burden to provide care for her. You had to make a choice, abandon her and move on with your life, or throw away a full ride scholarship and sacrifice your potential to take care of her. Are you ready to find out what choice you made? This is kind of exciting, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, I won't make you wait any longer. Okay, thank you. You chose to stay. You felt that it would be wrong to abandon her, especially when she needed you the most. She took care of you when you were abandoned, right? Yes. You were just returning the favor. If you haven't noticed, this area represents your old job. The one you worked while taking care of your grandmother after you graduated. Okay. The first thing you should probably do is sign in. Enter the door to your left and find your ID card. I'll speak to you soon. Good luck. <laughs> Okie dokie. I'll speak to him soon. But I just want to say a thank you very much to... I am Mr. Wack. Casper Live, baby. Oh, yay! Thanks very much for that five smackaroonies, mate. You bloody legend. Bloody legend. Hello, Mr. Action. Hello, Mr. Mace. How the devil are you? Right, so we need to go to the door on the left, or if you're French, Legorge. Have a piss. Ooh. 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 
Ooh. Could have put another urinal there. Waste of space. Okay. Let's get the ID card first. Where's my I? Here's my ID card. Yes. Look at the shiny floor. Oh, oh. I love the shiny floor. I love it, love it, love it, the shiny floor. Okay, clock in. Another day, another dollar. Number of boxes organized. I gotta do 50 of them? God damn. Bloody, bloody Jason. He, he should have done half of these. Really? I've got to do 50 of these bad boys? Are you fucking... Are you kidding me? <gasps> okay. Right. Join me after the break when I complete all these 50... I, I basically complete my job. Okay? What's going on? Okay. Are we, right, we've got, we've got the best button in the world. We've got 50. No? We've got run. We're running. We're running on the job. Look at this. I'm going to get a promotion in no time at all. Okay, here we go, here we go, come on. The boss is gonna love me. James, are you having fun organizing those boxes? Loving it, mate. Loving it. Do you want, uh, uh, do you want me to answer that? Can, can you take, pick up two at a time? Okay, we can't, we can't try, I've tried the door, we can't do the door yet. Shh. Something's gonna happen when you get to 10, isn't it? You know it, I know it, we all bloody know it. Who put them there? Why do they just put them straight in here? What a bunch of numpties. God damn and you boxes heavy? No. It must get pretty tiring doing this eight hours a day, five days a week. Love it, mate. No, I live for it. This time next year I'll be CEO. God damn. <laughs> the most entertaining game in history. The work simulator. Come on, you don't have to choose which shelf. Just put it on a bloody shelf. <sighs> fragile. They're not heavy, mate. They're fragile. 14. Jesus Christ. Did we clock out yet? Hey, I think you missed one. Well, Look yeah. over oh. there in the corner. Where? Eh? In the corner? Which corner, mate? There's four fucking corners. Ooh. Ooh. What's in the box? <laughs> What's in the box? What film's that from? I'll tell you, it's seven. What's in the box? <laughs> Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. Christmas time. Oh, we got bags as well. Okay. We can do bags. Okay. Oh, what? What? Okay. That reminds me of Christmas, these boxes. This is. Mate. I'm really sorry about the. The awesomeness of this game, right? Hey! I thought I just saw somebody there in my peripheral. peripheral in the corner of my eye. In peripheral. 
peripheral, in my peripheral, in my whatever. Let's get this one. Which one's the? There we go. Does it get tiring? No, I told you, mate. Yeah, don't rub it in. She's worth every single second of the day, my old gran. She's cool. She smells a bit, but she's cool. She lets me lick the bowl out when she makes cakes. Am I getting dizzy? Am I actually falling asleep? Am I streaming now? Am I sleeping? Is the screen going a bit funny? Waddy? Oh shit. I think I am. Do you ever feel regret? Maybe you should have just taken the scholarship and ran off. It's not what you know, mate. It's who you know. And I know the CEO right now, and he's getting old. And if I do all these 50 boxes when he's dead, I'll have his job and I will rule the world. <laughs> have you got that feeling I shouldn't be doing this? I, I don't know if I should be doing this, Caspers. I don't know. I mean, I, I, to be honest with you, I'm, I'm quite surprised that you're watching because let's do... Okay. Okay, we're we're fucking going. We're Rambo in this shit now. Every single day. Oh mate, we're on we're on a roll. Can we get get two in the get one under your arm? Look at me go. Look at me bloody go. Now I'm gonna be the CEO. I keep on looking down that door. I don't know. All we need to do is keep talking. Can we crouch and tiger? I thought we could crouch and tiger in this game. Almost there, Caspers. Thanks for coming to work. It's like bring it's bring you bring bring your friends to work day. And you're still here. You do all of it and nothing happens. Yeah, right. Hey, killer! How's it going, man? It might seem like I'm trying to belittle you, but I'm just relaying the thoughts you had at the time. Ten more. <laughs> Hi ho. Hi ho, it's off to work we go. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. It's an interesting concept, isn't it? Sacrificing the future for the present. Sacrificing all the potential to have a clear conscience. Was it worth it? I mean, we got left. Oh, mate. We might as well do the whole lot. It's not the 50. Let's get the. I can't leave. I can't leave, <coughs> I can't leave these. I can't do two more, I gotta do, come on, let me do some more, please. I've gotta do these now. There's only a few more left. I'll do the overtime for free. <coughs> come on, Ben, saw that chest out. <sighs> Here we go. Another job done. Wow, great job, James. Are you ready to start all over again tomorrow? No. I wanna. Uh, let me just. Let, fuck it. Let me just finish it off. I, I'm finishing off. I'm. I'm staying on. I'm staying on. I'm staying on, boss. I'm all over it, mate. Don't you worry about this. I've got it. I got it. I've got it under control. 
I can just get this goddamn box. Come on. What's your legs made out of? Poles? Bend over and pick the bloody box up. Bend your knees straight back. Assess this area. Check no one's behind you. All that stuff. Fuck it. I'm going to try this door. Sod it. Right. I've, 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 that's it. I'm going to clock out. Clock out. Clock out. What? Do we do all of them then? I need a piss after that. There you go. Okay, can I, can I leave now? Because I've done my job. Here we go. I did 53. I bet I got it. I would have got an achievement if I did all of it. Yes. Yes, indeed. Vera, hello. No, hello. I can do it. I know. I know. Not even a key to get out. I know. Shh. Get to bed! <laughs> if you are wondering, this game is made by Unity. Winchester girl with the 10 smackaroonies welcome back Winchester girl Shannon you you know what I'm gonna you know what I'm gonna say look at that beautiful you bloody legend thank you so much thank you so much welcome back I'll be right back what's that from what film's that from Ooh, something just loaded up then. Something just loaded up. Okay, let me just... Layla Zitterman. Hi, Casperside. Throwing a big hug from Sweden to you. Do you catch it? Oh. Oh. Yes, I did. That's a nice hug. That is a nice hug. Thank you so much. I want to go to Sweden. I want to take my camera and take loads of photographs of Sweden. Because I think Sweden's awesome. Oh, Sorrow. Okay. Can we just get it, get the F out? Mate, this is quite a nice place. There's definitely going to be a note in the kitchen. There's always a note in the kitchen. Excuse me. Look how Matt, that's Matt. That is an American fridge right there. That is fucking massive. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. Okay, there's not a note. She's not left me a note in the kitchen. Oh, 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 we've got a torch. I forgot. We got F, mate. Ha. 
hammer. Hammer for Christy. Oh, look at these boxes. Same sort of boxes at work. Maybe I've been stealing from work. Have I been stealing? Right, what am I going to need that hammer for? What is that? This little mini box. Okay, let's go. Don't need the torch on. Save, save, save it. All right, let's, let's Shimonte. Let's see what's going on in here, look. Oh, 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 here we go, Caspers. That is a big bloody fridge, isn't it? Hmm. The, the torch turns around so damn slow. What's in here? Nothing. <laughs> sorrow. What's all this sorrow about? What's it? Here we are, look. Come on, open up the bloody door. New member, welcome. I am Mr. Whack. You legend, mate. Thank you so much, dude. Right, could we smash the bloody window or something? Sorrow. What? Okay, take the bloody... Right, okay. Let's... Hang on. Let's have a look. look good look around on the walls here. In the bathroom. <gasps> Ooh. Maybe, like, it's one of those things where you have to... Shit! Okay, I wasn't expecting that sound effect. It's supposed to say, Freaky Deaky. I've messed up with the sound effects, I'm sorry. It shouldn't do that. It scared the crap out of me, though. <laughs> okay, <now. laughs> oh, God. What am I looking for? Hmm? Come on. Come on. If I was a note, where would I be? Would I be in the piano? Hmm. What do I do with this? How, where, the, where the F am I? Uh, uh, I'm feeling a bit I don't know man I just don't I, I've got it's funny I've got a spider sense coming I've got spider sense coming and I'm not liking it see this is what it does this game sometimes you do the same thing over and over and over again you start to like go crazy and then something happens and you're like what did I do and you don't know don't know what you did. <laughs> but I do love this game. Hang on, what's up here, look? A vent. Hmm. Okay. Oh. <laughs> that reminds me of that film. What's that film? When you turn off the lights and she's in the shadows. Oh, God, that film, mate. Oh. Pizza box. Okay, we're just gonna have to keep on doing loopy loopies. Can I? Why can't I open that up? Uh, nothing around here. Can't turn on the TV. Oh. Hmm. Maybe. Do I use the hammer on that sorrow note or something? I wonder if I use the hammer on the sorrow note. Let's try. What's the, um... No, I'm not gonna... Sorrow. Can we go to bed? What? What am I doing? Hmm. 
change my clothes? What do I do? It's very peculiar. I feel like I'm going mad, mate. We had to zoom in. Barricade. Yeah, I just stream on Twitch, videos on YouTube. But it, it is nice to do YouTube streaming. I'll be honest with you. I, I'll be honest with you. It is nice. It is nice this. <laughs> because we're quite new on um, on Twitch, we haven't got many followers. So um, if you're contemplating. Jumping over to Twitch to see us uh, st stream, please do so. It is free. Let's go on to Twitch. Log in. Type in Casper site and follow. Follow, follow, follow. Okay, where's this mumbling? Where's the. <laughs> Christ, wrong button. Right, I've got I've, I've got a feeling I know where, knows where she is. No, I knows where she is. I think I do. I think she's in the other one, isn't she? She's in the other place where we can go down. We can go downstairs like, no, where is that? It's this one here. I reckon she's in there, Matt. No, okay. Hmm. So now we've zoomed in on Sorrow, I think it may have changed to something else. Right. So we've we've blocked that up. We're, we're, we're trying to we're trying to save ourselves for something. We're protecting ourselves. What are we protecting ourselves from? Granny. We're protecting ourselves from Granny. Okay. Right, sorry if I'm making you drunk here. I mean, I'm just trying to... Trying to activate the horror, mate. Activate the bloody horror. Oh, what's this? <laughs> Here we go. Read V. Clean up any broken plates. High kitchen knife under the bed. Check emails on phone. Nail wooden planks on door. Okay. Turn off all the lights. Go to bed. <laughs> Clean up the broken plates. Let's do that. Let's go. Clean up the broken plates. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Clean up the broken plates. Hey. Ooh. One. Did it say something about a knife? I think You're it. Now a Casperian. You are now a bloody Casperian. Absolutely. Whoever that was, jumping on, being a Casperian, you bloody legend. House cleaner. Just got an achievement unlock. House cleaner. Yeah, boy. Hang on. If I've got an achievement saying that, that must mean that I've completed that exercise. So what I've got to do, check the phone for messages. Was that the other one? 
Let's have a little look. Create our broken plates. High kitchen knife under the bed. Okay. Check emails on phone. Okay, check emails on phone. There's the phone. The phone will be here. No? Where is the phone? Is it in my bedroom? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. It'll be in my bedroom. Check emails on my phone. Okay, hide the thing. There we go. Hide that under the bed. There you go. Oh, I see. This is where it all comes together, is it? Is it? Huh? Did that open up? Nope. Where's my bloody phone, mate? Have I got the phone on me? Is it a mobile phone? Or if you're American, cell phone. Or is it just a normal house phone? Or if you're American, house phone. I don't know. Don't ask me, mate. I've got to turn off all the lights as well, but I've got to find this phone first. Hang on! Something just loaded up. We activated the bloody horror, mate. Nah. Where's the bloody phone? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna edge this way. I'm gonna turn off all the mother chucking lights. Cause I'm a bad boy. Yeah. I'm a bad bad boy. Oh that coffee looks good though. Right, let's turn off the mother fucking lights. Yeah, because the phone's not in here. Let's close this door a minute. Where is this goddamn... F you weren't there earlier! Are you going to speak to me? It is unfortunate that you declined your scholarship program. Thank you for applying, and we hope that you are successful in your future academic endeavours. F you, mate. Okay. Right. I've got to turn off all the lights and go to bloody bed. Clear out the broken plates. Done. High kitchen knife under the bed. Done. Check emails on phone. Done. Now wooden planks on door. Done. Turn off all the lights. Almost. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here we go. We have to be very quiet. night you weirdo little bitch close the door leave it open a little bit little bit little bit more little bit more no yeah <laughs> why is that light on Okay, here we go. Turn that light off. Go to bed. Hang on. Oh, mate. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Good night. I can't move. <coughs> Shh. Shh. I can sense someone in the corner of my fucking room, mate. I can sense someone in the corner of my room looking at me. A dark shadow. Is someone in the house? 
They're going to take you. Get under the bed. That's a knock on the door. F you, mate. Oh my god! Fuck me, man! Get a knife! Get a fucking knife! That's that's the door that we barricaded up. Yasas, Yasa. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, goodness gracious me. Oh, that was tense, mate. That was tense. <laughs> oh, goodness. Goodness, goodness. Okay, shh, shh, shh. Let's get back in the mood. Oh mate, if there's some, if there's a figure, if there's a figure standing there or something, if there's a shadow, I hate shadows, mate. I fucking hate shadows. Please don't be a shadow. Pete. <gasps> Ew. F you, mate. Oh, God. Yeah, it's so tense. Ah, it's so I'm fine. Mate, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Oh fucking hell, mate. This is just like that film. This is just like that film when you turn off the lights and she's there. Do you know what this game reminds me of? It's another game that I've played. Ah, oh, man. What's that other game I played when you're in a house and you go up into the room? Uh, oh, what's that game I played? It's a really good game. Because it's set, 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 century? Set, sanity? Set, sanitary? Uh, I don't know. Something like that. Oh, fuck me. She's gone downstairs, hasn't she? She's gone downstairs. We're gonna have to check it out. What What am I doing investigating? What the, what the F are you doing, Ben? <laughs> Just get out. Get to the front bloody door. Oh, please, mate. Fucking go! F you! Turn on the lights! F you! Can't! Ah. Uh, uh. Oh god, she's gonna be in my bed! She wants it! She's gonna be in my bed! Hang on, we're talking about my gran, aren't we? Whatever. Forget you heard that. Uh, uh, oh no, she's not in the bed. Get the bloody knife. Get the bloody knife. Okay, F you. Okay, so what are we doing then? What are we doing? Do we zoom in on that again? What's the time? 
What am I doing? I, I'm just gonna have to just gonna have to keep on walking around, guys. Ha! Do I have a note? Any? What, 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 what that note says? What what that note says? Is the, is the note changed? No, it doesn't. Maybe I should go back to bed. Forget I ever even saw it. What's this? Is this? Is there another? Is there another one? No. Okay. She's just playing with us. She's just bloody playing with us, mate. Oh man, just imagine, just imagine doing this in real life. You've just seen that. You're naked, you sleep naked, so you're now naked in a kitchen, in a dark house, wandering around looking for some mentalist in your house, and you're naked in the dark with a bloody torch. That's all you've got, <laughs> mate. Okay, okay. We can't, we can't. We can't clean it up. It's still there. The I've just... Shouldn't I... How about we reverse it all now? We turn the lights on... We can't turn the lights on, Ben. You can't turn the light. It's... Okay, 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 okay. There's got to be something down here. We're missing something down here. Is it the boxes? What is it, mate? What is it? What are you telling me? What are you showing me? Come on. What, what are you trying to say? Don't be a head in there. There's nothing. You're not telling me anything. Oh! Pain. Are you full of it? Patience. Are you out of it? When will your suffering end? That's activated the horror. If something that activated the horror, yeah, that's that. That's it. That has just activated the bloody horror. That's so activated the horror. Oh God, I'm just, I'm, I'm just going in here and sort of like trying to activate so it knows where I've been and it, it knows where I've been. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I'm sorry. Patience. Shush. Are you full of it? Patience. Are you out of it? James. Jamie, hello, mate. I'm all good. Thanks, buddy. You wanted her to die. Not for her sake, but for your own. Oh, shit. You yearned for her death, not because her suffering would cease. It was because yours would cease as well. I'm bloody mental, mate, aren't I? I'm, I'm bloody mental. Oh, Gran, I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry, Gran. Gran, I'm so sorry. Gran? She's so she's super pissed. Huh? 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 She's it. Oh, fuck me, mate. She's gone on a bloody computer, checked out my porn. Oh, shit. Shush. Today I found my laptop broken. I left her alone for just a few minutes while I was in the bathroom, and I guess she walked in my bedroom and had an episode. I have to drain my savings in order to replace it. Shit. She's broke my laptop? Bitch. Oh God, why well, I've got a feeling. I've got a funny feeling. 
That tonight's gonna be a good night That tonight's gonna be a good, good night Huh? Oh god! Okay guys, we're gonna have to leave it there. We'll see you on the next stream. Just joking. Where are you, Granny? 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 Here, Granny. Do you feel the resentment pulsating through your veins? Do you feel the last breath of patience exiting your body? Do you feel the rage welling up, overflowing, displacing empathy, sympathy, and love? Do you hear it? It's calling you. A way out. Follow it. Let it guide you. Okay, follow it, let it guide me. Let it guide me to the wrong place. Let's let's okay, let's guide. Let's let's go. Yes, I do feel it. Yes, I sense it. It's calling me. Action! Welcome back, Ben! Five smackaroonies, you legend, matey. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Action. Ah! Oh, Alicia! Ten smackaroonies from the US of A. Or maybe... It's a US. Yes. Happy New Year. Thank you so much. You were so very kind. Some sexy brand new US dollars, baby. Oh yeah. Thanks guys, I really appreciate it, man. Shush. And that wasn't me being rude, that was just, shh. What the fuck? A brutal crime scene emerged this weekend within the quiet suburban neighbourhood. Two victims, Neil Young and Sarah Young, were viciously stabbed by an unknown assailant. The two, <coughs> the two parents leave an, an uh, leave an infant son behind. Authorities did not. I've read this. Authorities did not have a lead, and it was reported that each victim was stabbed over thirty times, result, resulting in the face of the victims to be heavily disordered and mangled. The, the brutal crime. Is this what I've collected? Truth. Achievement unlocked. While sifting through some old boxes, you found an interesting set of documents that revealed the truth about your past. Your grandparents were involved in an accident that killed your grandfather and your infant brother. It wasn't your grandmother's fault entirely, but your parents couldn't help but put the blame on her. With no family or friends left, living a hopeless and bleak existence, your grandmother decided to murder them. With your parents out of the way, she could raise you all by herself. Her desire was selfish and evil. That was all you needed. A way to justify her death. A way to break the burden of taking care of her. Do you remember what you did? I'll walk you through it once more, just in case you've forgotten. I'll read this a minute, mate. A fatal accident occurred last week. Yeah, I've read all this. We've read all this. This is just the evidence I've picked up, isn't it? Now we're going to get some sort of reenactment of how I did it. 
Okay, he's going to show me the way. He's going to show me what I bloody did. Here we go, look. Here we go. Here we go, mate. Red. Evil! Get the knife. Get the new radio. Get the phone. Place the knife under on her bed. Replace the old radio. Place the phone on the table outside the, the door. Wait outside the room. Okay. Get the knife, get the new radio, get the phone. Knife, radio, phone. Knife, radio, phone. Okay. Ooh. Okay, this is... Right, that's her. Right, okay. That's her. That's her room. So we need the knife, radio. Oh, let's look at this. Knife, radio, phone. Okay. Okay. Okay, right, it's right there. Let's go. Okay. This is what I did. Didn't it say put the phones? Where did it say put the phone? Let's just uh, read this a minute. Place the knife on a bit. Get the phone. Place the old radio. Place the phone on the table outside the door. Okay. This is sick. Thank you. 
You will not be missed. Thanks. Thanks so much. James, you murdered her. You knew about her delusions. She always talked about the man in the radio, so you decided to become that character. What a bastard. You replaced the old radio and then played an audio file telling her to stab herself repeatedly with a knife. You knew she was delusional and had episodes of schizophrenia. She followed your instructions and eventually bled to death due to her self-inflicted injuries. Since all the evidence pointed to a suicide, you weren't charged with anything. You finally got what you wanted. You were finally free. You might be wondering how exactly you ended up dead. Well, for the first few months, you lived your life carefree. You actually enjoyed life to some extent, not being tied down by an ill relative. But eventually, that all came crashing down. It started off with brief, horrific, gruesome nightmares. Visions of her stabbing herself endlessly, blood gushing out of her wounds, flooding your mind with blood-red guilt. Slowly, these nightmares leak into your daily life. You'd see her out of the corner of your eye, whether you were driving, walking down the street, or at work. Even though you killed her, she never really left. She lived in your mind and haunted you every day until you eventually couldn't fall asleep. Every time you closed your eyes, even for the briefest of moments, she'd manifest in your subconscious. Eventually you went to the hospital and you were prescribed sleep medicine, but that only suppressed the issue. Slowly your body adjusted to the medicine and you needed to increase the dose for the medicine to be effective. This process kept repeating until you were taking multiple times the recommended amount. You were addicted, until one night you overdosed on sleep medication. Right now, in this moment, your physical body is currently in a hospital bed, hovering between the thin line of life and death. You're still probably wondering why you're here in God's basement. I'll finally tell you who I am. If I have to choose, let me know. Really is. Wake up or die, tell me. God's basement is a realm for those who have committed great sin, but are still redeemable. The individuals that arrive in God's basement relive their own versions of hell, allowing them to reflect on their life and watch their slow descent into evil. Their resentment, hate, bitterness, and jealousy accumulate until those emotions manifest themselves through atrocious acts, yours being murder. You were backed into a corner, watching your life slowly pass you by. All those opportunities you sacrificed, all that potential wasted, you became bitter and resentful. Many could sympathize with you. Many might have even done the same. You were hopeless, and it felt like you were inside a living hell. I am called the Operator. The Operator. I am an entity that manifests in God's basement. I manifest myself in different ways depending on the person. My job is to guide the person inside God's basement <coughs> and allow them to relive their life from a different perspective. In your case, I manifested with many characteristics resembling the man in the radio. Hopefully this explanation cleared everything up. Very much so. You're still probably wondering what happens now that you have all your memories. I mentioned earlier that God's basement are for those who are still redeemable. Even though you committed an atrocious sin, you were trapped in a hopeless existence also, the person you killed wasn't really your grandmother. 
she was a shell of her former self. Your grandmother died long ago. Part of you wanted to see her suffering cease. Your crime was both cruel and merciful at the same time. You are going to get a second chance at life. Pretty soon you're going to wake up in a hospital bed out of your drug-induced coma. Learn to live with what you did. The feelings of guilt, paranoia, and pain will never completely go away. James, make the most out of life, and be grateful for this second chance. One last thing. Good luck. Fini. The game is fini. Uh huh. Or is it? Uh, oh my god. I had such a... Such a strange dream. I had a dream I was... Halfway between... It must have been heaven or hell. What is this? Am I in a hospital? Why do I feel so rough? Mom? Dad? Gran? Oh yeah, they're dead. God's Basement. What a fucking good game. Hey? Excuse my effing language. What an effing good game. Now that is what you call a bloody indie game, mate. Yes. Thank you. No, 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 no. Thank you for making it. And thank you for watching. I bloody love games like that, mate. I love games like that. What did you think? What did you think of that? Nice one, Wolf Girl. Nice action. Hey, out of ten. Come on, let's see, let's see your ratings. Out of ten, what do you reckon? If you've seen, obviously, the beginning. We've reached the end. I want to say thank you for playing the whole game. I'm still pretty new to creating video games. You're still pretty new. That's pretty damn awesome, mate. So you think it was bearable? Hopefully you enjoyed the experience. Maybe someday you'll play another one of my games if I'm able to release another one. You fucking better do, mate. Because let me tell you, <coughs> not only is that game bloody awesome, one of the best games I've played, one of the best indie games I've played. I'm putting it out there, mate. Because you got the tension, bang on. You got the atmosphere, bang on. The sound's great. You know... Uh, but the main thing is it you really wanted to get involved with the story. You really wanted to follow the story. It wasn't too complicated and things going fucking left, right and centre. And didn't You know, it was explained well. Really good ending, mate. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. And you really you work with that unity pretty damn well. Yeah, that's good. Maybe next one you could try... Delving into un, um, Unreal Engine. That might be nice. But yeah, I like that. 7 out of 10. Okay. Ayo Lexia, 10 out of 10. Okay. Wolf Girl, 7 out of 10. Yeah, no, that was pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. There you go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for all the, the uh, super chats and... All your lovely comments and chilling out and watching it with me. I'm going to go and watch probably uh, A Walking Dead now. We're going to go watch A Walking Dead. Um, and that is it. I'm going to be on Twitch again streaming. So if you haven't gone over to Twitch yet, remember it's free, guys. So you just, log, you just type, type Twitch, log in, search for me, follow. That'd be great. And again, 
you know videos on youtube more horror coming i've got vr horror and the indie horror i know i'm still a little bit rough at the moment but i am gonna get back in the swing of it now that the new year's all done and the christmas is all done and i'm back from holiday and all that lot you guys are bloody awesome have a good morning afternoon evening or whatever you're doing take care bye bye what a bloody good game man <laughs>